I got a feeling that by the time we finish this episode, you will be so inspired that maybe you will start your own restaurant. But I'm going to take no guarantee for this, guys. This is very, very difficult business. But some people have really made it. Like these three boys came together. They had this passion of creating some amazing food and sharing with everybody who's passionate about food. So they got together and pulled in their blood, their sweat, their money, and everything that they had to start a restaurant called Walk Boys. So Walk Boys is the brainchild of three uh, foodies here in Dubai. What they wanted to do was bring the authentic flavors of the streets of Asia to Dubai and fill that gap in the market. Um, we have street food here in Dubai, which is our shawarmas, which is a very authentic Middle Eastern um, type of dish. But we don't have any other, we don't have a strong presence of other street food. So bringing the Asian street food to Dubai was um, a key factor for them. Um, the idea behind Walk Boys is to give the customers the freedom to choose and to create their own type of dish. So placing that freedom and the power into the hands of the customer. So the best seller here at Walk Boys is what your palate desires. Now, the way that they can do that is come up to the venue, look at the different variations of proteins, freshly sourced vegetables, garnishes, toppings, um, sauces, and create their own type of wok, bring out the inner chef in them. Although there is a wide variety of options, some of their best sellers, of course, are the jasmine rice, the soba noodles, and the quinoa, which is a very rare offering, especially in Asian street food. Uh, for the protein, that would be the chicken and the prawns, the vegetables, it's just a variety there. And for their sauces, their best seller would be the Wok Boy Special, which is a fusion of chili, basil sauce, tossed in garlic. And that's not all, because we've got a lot more on the menu. We've got various sauces, different garnishes, proteins, and freshly sourced vegetables. So just adding to that street urban vibe, they've come up with really unique and quirky type of names, um, especially for their sauces, which are the Wok Boy Special, the Gangnam Style, the Tuk Tuk, Pepper Yin Yang, Japanese Sizzle. So it's really fun names that they put to each of the dishes. The Big Graffiti Wall, yes, there's, there's a really good story behind that. The founders have all been here since the early 80s and they kind of wanted to show some patronage to the UAE through this mural um, and show their underlying love for it. So they've implemented a few iconic um, buildings into this, this mural, showing the old side of Dubai and the, the new side with um, you know, the Burj Khalifa and then the clock tower, which has been around for ages. Um, they've also implemented a bit of Asian style into that with the, with the character here and um, you know, with, the, with the chopsticks, so it's a beautiful graffiti painting that was actually done by uh, a very talented Turkish artist. So that type of atmosphere here at Walk Boys is street style, go with the flow, and an after-party hotspot because this entire area is filled with bars and clubs. So at that time of night, you've got a really good crowd walking up and down these streets. We would love for you to come down to Walk Boys and immerse yourself in Asian street food in an urban environment and get your creativity rolling. Wow.